Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how we can write a JK flip-flop programming using Verilog in Dataflow modeling. So usually in data, in data flow modeling, we can write a coding by means of using an expressions for gate level modeling by means of using an uh, logic gates and behavior level modeling by means of using a truth table. So here uh, for data flow modeling, we need a following expression. So here for JK flop, the next state for the Q is given as a Q n bar J plus Q n into K bar. So we are going to implement this corresponding expression in the corresponding coding. So let us start writing a coding module with a keyboard. Module is a keyword and corresponding JK flip-flop is the identifier. The output is Q and Q bar and the inputs are J, K and clock. The input variables are j, k and clock and the output variables are q and q bar. If you write directly as a q assign q bar q is equal to uh, q bar j plus q and k bar in the Teflon modeling is expression so for next state there will be error tends to occur so we can use by means of having an and mixed level modeling by means of mixing your behavioral level modeling with your corresponding following expression let's see how it can be done i am going to declare the q as a register always in behavioral level modeling you should declare the q as a output as a registers so since the q is output i have declared the q as a register and then the initial condition for q is 0 i have initial conditions initial condition is 0 for q and then always and we are designing for negative edge trigger flip flop so always at negative edge clock it will come inside the loop whenever the negative edge occurs the, it will come inside the loop for the clock signal so always at negative edge clock signal it will come inside the loop so here we can give the following expression assign q is equal to q is equal to corresponding q bar into j plus q into k bar negation of q and j and or q n into k bar so k and sorry k bar so since it is k bar i need to use negative symbols k and q so once we have written the corresponding expression then we can write that q bar is equal to q bar is equal to negation of q negation of q and n module so now we will try this program in the xilinx uh, model scene let's see So we have written the equation, so it should be assigned q bar is equal to negation of q. Then we can check the syntax. So 
source center has been verified then we can write it as branch new source umbrella test fixture jk test next next finish so here jk and clock is there so as we see for sf flop we will vary for only for jk at last we can give the corresponding clock signal so at, at first it will be 0 0 then it is 0 1 and 1 0 and 1 1 and then we can give another condition is 1 0 then after any it is give clock condition always as 50 clock is equal to negation of clock we have given for all the cases for j and k and then we have taken the clock as a common and then we have got the let's see the output here c when j and k is 0 it's in sense it is negative to trigger flip flop when j and k is 0 the corresponding flip table we can see when j and k is 0 q is equal to q so we have initially we have assigned as a q is equal to 0 so since we have initialized q is equal to 0 in the output we can see here q is equal to 0 then at when clock becomes 0 the k becomes 1 once k becomes 1 then we can find a corresponding truth table when k is 1 when k is 1 the output is 0 so we can find here the q is 0 and q bar is 1 once again once the clock goes negative j becomes 1 we can find here in the, in the, in the left hand side j becomes 1 so once j becomes 1 the corresponding truth table is j is equal to 1 k is equal to 0 the output is 1 so here we can find your output q as a 1 and q bar is a 0 then when both j and k are 1 1 then when the clock is negative is triggered we can find that then q is equal to 1 q is equal to 1 and q bar is equal to 0 thank you